Recently, we had the most astonishing sighting. Ten wild dogs, a clan of hyenas, and a little black-backed jackal. Have a look at this. People, there's an incredible sighting going on. This is the best possible view we can get, I'm afraid, though. But you can see all the dogs and the hyenas chasing each other. And so the dogs killed the kudu. The hyena clan, whose den is just nearby there, came in. And they stole what remained of the little kudu. There's a jackal. There's a black-backed jackal in there as well. It's the first black-backed jackal I've seen here. Yeah, just, just, it's as bright as unbelievable. How cool is that? Here we go. The dogs are chasing the young hyenas. This hyena might be killed. When they're outnumbered, the dogs will absolutely attack hyenas. And you saw the way she backed in under that tree. Now, some might consider that strange. She basically cornered herself, but it's not unusual. The whole reason she did it, of course, was because that way the dogs had to face her business in. They had to face those terrible chomping jaws, and you can see how they backed away from it. And the wild dogs are not really going to risk mm -mm. those big jaws and a major injury. Uh, when a hyena's facing them like that. So that is a, generally a hyena's really best defense against a pack of wild dogs. And you saw there how those 10 dogs, once the hyena had backed herself effectively under the tree, they eventually just backed off, despite the fact that it was numbers of about eight or 10 to one. If she hadn't managed to back under that bush, I suspect quite strongly that she would have eventually been worn down and killed by the dogs. She's easily identifiable by the scar on her back, and we haven't seen her again. And look at the backside, look at the backside of that hyena. She's been absolutely mauled. Wow. Now, the interesting thing there is that a black-backed jackal which I have never seen in this area before, came slinking in. And Brent, you've also seen something like that. Very, very similar, again in bots, and almost the exact same thing, except we just swapped a kudu for lechwe, and uh, the wild dogs and, and the hyenas were just going at it. There was a little pair of black-backed jackal, and they literally got in there and scoffed as much meat as possible in the shortest amount of time before the other larger predators sort of realized what was going on.